Hey everybody. Okay, so you've had a po' boy, right? Po' boy sandwich. We've all had them. They're cool, right? But uh, I got to thinking, why settle for a po' boy when you can have a rich man? And yes, I am still talking about food because today I'm going to show you my play on the po' boy sandwich using fried lobster tails. Yes, and I call it the rich man sandwich. <laughs> all right, I know I had you at lobster, so just keep on watching, okay? To start the sandwich, you'll need fresh lobster tails, Cajun seasoning, hot sauce, an egg, flour, panko breadcrumbs, and oil for frying. Now, as you can see, I've removed the shell off my lobster tail, and I'm gonna take a bamboo skewer and stick it right down the center of the lobster. Make sure it goes all the way through to the bottom because this is gonna keep it straight while it cooks, okay? So now I have my dredging station for um, frying. So I have some Cajun seasoning and I'm gonna add it to my flour here. Mix it up a little bit. So we'll start with the flour. You wanna roll your lobster tail, make sure it gets evenly coated in the flour. Cool, and then now we're gonna move on to our egg wash station. Now, I don't know about you, but where I'm from, we season even our egg wash. So I have some hot sauce here. I'll pour that in. Shake off a little bit of flour and then make sure I roll it right in that egg wash and that hot sauce mixture. Perfect. And then last, we'll go with our panko breadcrumbs. If yours are already seasoned, you don't have to worry about it. If they are plain, just add a little bit of salt and pepper and it'll be perfect to go. All right, roll that right in there. And the panko is gonna help it get nice and crunchy as it fries up. All right, now we take it to the oil. Now I've got my oil heating up in a pan and we're gonna test it with a little bit of flour, make sure, oh, that is nice and hot. When it starts to dance in the pan like that, that's that flour test, you know it's ready. Okay, so now we have our lobster tail skewered up. We're gonna place it in our pan. That is the sound of something perfect happening in your pan. That means it's the right temperature. You should hear that sizzle and see those bubbles going. Now you're gonna let this cook just until the panko breadcrumbs start to get golden brown and your lobster tail is cooked all the way through. And it won't take a long time because you know seafood cooks quickly. So make sure you keep an eye on it so that it doesn't burn or overcook. So here we have our lobster tails fried up perfectly golden brown. I have them resting on a paper towel to drain off any excess oil and I remove the bamboo skewer. So now it's time to make our rich man sandwich, all right? So I have here a nice soft hoagie bun and I put a little butter and toasted it in the pan because you gotta make sure you treat your, your bread right. Give it a little love, a little butter, toast it up. It gives it a nice base for your sandwich. And I have some toppings here. We have to do what's called dress your sandwich. So I have here a little mayo and some minced garlic and a little bit of hot sauce. So I have a little aioli going on here. So we'll spread it on the bottom. Good, and you can do as little or as much as you like. And always make sure you sauce both sides of the bread, yes. All right, then we have some tomato, a little bit of pickle, all right, we're gonna top off our beautiful lobster tail. And then just a little bit of lettuce. Oh, I see you drooling. And we'll put it all together. Oh my. <laughs> no, you gotta get a close up of this. All right, take a look at that. That is a whole lobster tail deep fried with a spicy aioli, lettuce, tomato, and pickles on a soft bun. This is the rich man sandwich. You saw it here first. Oh my goodness. All right, I'm about to dig into this, but it's gonna get a little messy. So I don't wanna do it in front of you. Me and my rich man are gonna be alone, but you need to make your own. Check out this recipe and my YouTube channel, because it's all kinds of crazy ideas like this, and you're gonna love each and every one of them. My YouTube channel is Chef Jamika Official. Me and my sandwich. We'll see you later.